Uh, thanks, Ben. Um, it's a great honour to be able to um, present this award uh, on behalf of my late father. Um, for those of you who certainly are younger in the room um, and wouldn't have known my dad, um, Dad's journey with the club began in 1963 as a Colts player. Um, he was part of the first ever Colts Premiership side in 1965. Played in four reserves premierships, 1968, 69, 76, 77. Uh, he was playing coach of the reserves in 1978. Um, was awarded life membership of this club in 1979 and retired as a player at the end of the 1980 season. He went on uh, to become reserves team manager in 1983 and uh, served in that role until 1988. Uh, in 1989, he joined the board of directors, uh, which uh, he held that position until 1996. He was also league team manager in, from 1989 through to 1997, um, and recruiting manager during probably what is the club's most successful ever period in history, from 1990 through to 1992, when the club became the first in the South West Football League to win three successive league flags. He went on to become Colts team manager in 2001 until 2006, uh, before returning as reserves team manager in 2007. Uh, he also had a second stint on the board from 2009 to 2012. Um, he served the club um, in non-official roles with past players and uh, just basically gave his heart and soul to this club. Um, you know, it's something I saw firsthand, starting from Yay High, um, when I was basically his shadow around here. Um, I was pretty lucky to have that patch of grass out there as my playground, and this room we're standing in was basically my cubby house growing up. Um, all thanks to my dear old dad. Um, yeah, like I said, he gave his heart and soul even after his diagnosis with motor neuron disease um, at the beginning of 2017, um, which we saw him bravely fight um, until unfortunately the final siren sounded for him in November 2018. Um, the winner of this award, um, Dad would be extremely proud to see this young man who has won this award. Um, I can remember the day um, Dad rang me one night after a game. He said, oh, I've got to present a league jumper tonight, or today. And um, it was the first time he'd been asked by the club to present a league jumper. To a, de to a debutant, and um, he followed him pretty closely, this player. And uh, after Dad passed away, um, I followed him pretty closely too. And um, I know Dad would be extremely proud. Um, I mean, it's even written on Dad's tie. That's um, probably the one thing he'd summoned him up was pride, and that's written on his tie here, going back from 1991. Um, and uh, he'll definitely be smiling down on the winner of tonight's award, and that's Ty Anderson.